Yeah, good day, people of God. I just want to share a quick scripture and a quick testimony as, as I travel home. You know, just a meditation. Um, Luke 14, verse 26. It was a scripture taught to me at an early time in my, my Christian walk with the Lord. Um, that if you don't hate your mother, your father, your sister, I'm just, I'm just extending it. Your sister, your, your, your job, your, your own life, it goes on saying, you can't be, be my disciple. And it's literally saying that the love what you have for God must be above everything else in your entire life. And so at this moment, at this moment in time, there's so many things fighting to take the place of God. There's so many things, your job, uh, whether you, your workplace, you know, um, your, your spouse, your family. There's so many things trying to occupy your time to take the place of God. And we have to be very careful and be very discerning and watchful to see what are the things that will try to stop us and try to take the place of God in our lives. Because if we don't put God first, trust me, things are not going to go well for you. Right? The Bible says that seek ye first the kingdom of God and all of his righteousness and all these things shall be added unto you. Right? That scripture is a powerful one right there. Because we must always go back to the cross to see where our love is or who do we love or what do we love above God. And so, today I want to say that I don't want to love anybody else but God. I don't want to love anything else but God. And I'm saying that I don't want to put anything else above the love of God right now in my life. And so, I don't want to do anything else but... I don't want to love anybody else but God. So just, just be encouraged and put God first, people. In Jesus' name. Bible.